Hey guys, it's Armstricken, and today we're doing a review on my EDC Pocket Organizer by Maxpedition. You can pretty much tell this thing's packed with stuff. I use this thing constantly. It sits in my Maxpedition Lunata. Um, love this piece. It's really high quality nylon. You can tell the stitching and the weaving on it is very high quality. This material is extremely strong. It's the same uh, 1050 denier water and uh, abrasion resistant ballistic nylon fabric found in a lot of combat boots. I know Bates ultralights have the 1050 denier. So this stuff is really rugged and strong. So let's take a look at what I have in here. Right off the bat, up front here, I have a razor blade with protective cover on it. And I have a bunch of tape wrapped around a uh, old, like a membership card, gift card thing. And you can see that the pocket itself is Velcro closed. So if you put something in here, it's staying in there. You have a uh, Velcro piece up top here for any kind of camaraderie patches. On the back, I have some zip ties that I cut and some metal uh, wire. Really smooth YKK quality zippers. This is not cheap junk zippers that are going to spread. Put some power cord here as the pull. Open it up, and you have all of this. Right off the bat, you see I have a razor blade, disposable style razor blade with uh, breakable pieces, a paint marker, a pen, a Sharpie with more tape, packaging tape that's wrapped around it. We have our Gerber splice, a really handy, cheap little tool, but a very high quality. I mean, if you don't know what Gerber is, then I suggest you start learning. Um, you have serrated blades, scissors, screwdrivers, bottle openers, uh, nail files. I mean, this is a really good piece. You can find a review video and primarily scissors, really razor sharp scissors up front here. You can find a review on the uh, Gerber Splice, about 20 bucks at your local sports authority. Awesome piece. Moving right along, a uh, common paper clip. Got these at the dollar store. What I like about them is that they're individually wrapped. It's not common to find this. Whole bag for a buck at the dollar store. Can't beat that. Set that aside for right now. Uh, nail clippers, uh, headbands. You know, you laugh, but they're not only for women. You can find a lot of uses for headbands. You know, you, you might want to tie something down or uh, roll up a piece of paper. You know, some targets, you're at the range and they're kind of all over the place. You don't want to fumble with some tape. Headband it. On the bottom here, I have a sewing kit that I took from a hotel room. Really awesome. Uh, I never actually used it, but I did use the needle the other day for uh, a splinter that I had. One of these fingers I had a splinter at work. Got it right out. Just hit the needle with a lighter, sterilize it, and we're good to go. In the back here, something I picked up at a dollar store. Um, another little multi-tool. You can tell some small pliers, Phillips head, and a flathead screwdriver. And when you close it, it can lock around this loop here. For a nice secure fit. In the back, I have a notepad. In the notepad, I have uh, 20 bucks, uh, copies of my insurance card, uh, driver's license, and vehicle registration. Good notepad. You don't really need to spend money on right in the rain. Um, here I have some tags that will go along with these metal loops here. I could tag my way back out of a forest, or I could tag my way back, or, you know, leave a note and tie it around something. Um, if I was there at that location, I have a bunch of these back here in the back there. All the way in the back here, I have zip ties going through the Maxpedition uh, clothing tag. And back there, I have some something else I picked up at a dollar store. Brand new little bottle of super glue. You never know when you might need it. And that's pretty much it, guys. I've used this kit constantly. Very quality uh, stitching materials are awesome. I absolutely love this piece. Um, I got a black one for the missus. She loves it. She keeps it in the car. 
with all her little odds and ends in there. I, I, I would highly suggest you guys get this versus any of the um, other smaller name brand stuff like Voodoo or anything else. I'm not knocking Voodoo or any other brand. I just have experience with Maxpedition, and I can tell you it is rugged. It is going to last you, and you won't have to invest. You know, you could pack this thing full and not have to worry about a zipper bursting at the seams, spending 20 bucks. You can spend 25 30 and get this and never have to worry about it. Thanks for watching, guys. It's I'm Stricken, and I'm out.